Section 1, subsection 1, clause L of the PESR defines expansible fluid as a vapor or gaseous fluid or a liquid under pressure and at a temperature at which the liquid changes to a gas or vapor when the pressure is reduced to atmospheric pressure or when the temperature is increased to ambient temperature. This means that a liquid such as room temperature propane is expansible because it will flash into a vapor if the pressure is reduced to atmospheric pressure. Ambient temperature is not defined in the regulation, but is considered to be a standard temperature, such as 15 degrees Celsius, as opposed to a winter ambient temperature in northern Alberta, for example, which could be minus 40 degrees Celsius. Chapter 5 the design registration process. Due to the nature of pressure equipment and the significant dangers of a failure, designs submitted for registration must follow a very stringent procedure. Designs that are not submitted in accordance with this procedure will not be registered and will require resubmission, pushing the application to the back of the queue. When a design is submitted correctly, ABSA's target for completing its initial review is 15 working days from receipt of the submission. Recapping, the AB31 design registration application provides ABSA with the information necessary to populate its database, and it reminds the submitter of the other forms or information that might be required for specific kinds of registration, such as the AB41 forms for fittings design registrations or the AB96 forms for piping design registrations. Once a design submission has been logged into APSA's database, the submitter will automatically receive an acknowledgement of the entry along with the tracking number for that submission, the contact information for the design surveyor who will be evaluating the design, and the date by which a response from APSA can be expected. After a design has been approved and registered by APSA, an acceptance letter, which references the design, date of registration, and registration number, is issued to the applicant by an ABSA Safety Codes Officer. A list of fitting category letters established by CSA B51 can be viewed in the course materials. The number 2 after the decimal point is Alberta's designator. If a piece of equipment is already registered by another province, that province's designator would appear between the decimal point and the Alberta designator. For example, M1974.5200 indicates that the boiler or pressure vessel design was registered in the province of Ontario, which uses the designator 5 and has been subsequently registered for the province of Alberta.